So I've wrote, written the program so that when I go close and um, Ezra doesn't see any light, he'll close his eyes. And if I come closer, I think he's supposed to frown, and if not, he'll smile. So he'll react to you and to yeah. the light conditions, yeah. all right? And so what drives Ezra? What, um, what drives his face? Servo motors, unmodified servo motors. All right. All right, can, so you've got a little demo program there. So now if I cover the solar sensor, it goes away. Oh, neat. And then if I come close. Oh, he goes, like ooh. Yeah. So close, he'll go, ooh. Mm -hmm. And if I cover up his, his little light sensor there, his eyes will close. Oh, I like it. Okay, great. Maybe uh, if we shine a really bright light on it, he can close his eyes. Okay. Something like that. So yeah. what do you hope to do with this later on? Um, I'm trying to make a more detailed emotion library so that there are lots of different expressions. And, um, so I want to make it smoother than the way he interacts with the environment. I love it. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, good luck. Um, so now Ezra is going to demonstrate all of his emotions from disgruntled, happy, unhappy, and shocked. And then at the end, he'll start to interact with the environment, um, this is closing his eyes if it's too dark and frowning if something's too close to him. Closing his eyes if it's too light. If it's too light, yeah. yeah, yeah okay. That's disgruntled. This is my sister and my dad. Uh -huh. My dad Shock. <laughs> and, uh, so I think he senses something too close, and it's light. So he's not happy there. So he's happy again. If we cover up his little light sensor. No. Come on, Ezra. Uh oh. Oh, maybe it's a delay.